Hello everyone, my dear students, Assalamu Alaikum and Ramadan Mubarak to all of you. Welcome to my ICT class that is Information, Communication and Technology. Today, I am going to take the class of class 7. Our classwork number is 12. And today, we are going to learn about ICT in daily life. Chapter 1, Lesson 7. Later on, you can see the book from page number 15 to 17. My name is Rokaya Banu. I am your ICT teacher from English medium senior section, sector 7 of Milestone School and College in Uttara Dhaka. So, my dear students, how are you all? Hope you all are fine and staying at home safely and as well as doing the classes regularly. So, let's start the class. First of all, we will know about information and communication technology in social life. New technologies frequently come into being in this world, though we do not get the information right away. So, it does not have any impact on us. But, information and communication technology is such a kind of advanced technology which has immensely been influencing our lives since its invention. You can see here is a picture given below. A lady is working from her home. Youth of today do not work since 10 a.m. to 5 p.m. going to office rather than they like to work staying at home. Information and communication technology is not only used in important state affairs and in the international events, but also in the lives of common beings. If you look around, you will watch that the people of your acquaintance, kin, teachers, classmates, and you yourself in one way or another are using the technology. The textbook which you are reading right now is written by someone, printed by using the information technology, and thus brought before you. So, you can read it. There are plenty of examples like this. Websites of Social Communication Information and communication technology has made our social communication fast, attractive, and effective. Besides, many of our social affairs are included into the Internet Protocol. It is said in the previous lesson that if you want to communicate anything with your dear ones, you yourself have to send either the mail or SMS, but if it happens that what you are doing is automatically being known to your friends, how do you feel then? Some websites of social communication came into being from this idea. Information of social functions, professions, liking and disliking, photographs or videos of family affairs, etc. can easily be shared through one of those sites. Currently, we have hundreds of websites of this nature like Facebook, Twitter, Zupa, MySpace are very popular among them. Here you can see a picture of Facebook timeline. Millions of people are using Facebook nowadays. People of almost all the languages of the world use these kinds of websites. Of those websites, the Facebook is used most. Millions of people are using Facebook. The number of users is gradually increasing in Bangladesh. Every user can create a self-introducing web page, either in the Facebook or in similar websites. 
The user gives the information of himself or herself and displays his or her photographs, videos, etc. in his profile from where he finds out his friends. Here, friend is not meant in the conventional sense. According to the Facebook, how many friends a man or woman of his acquaintance has will all be his friends. If your friend has a Facebook profile and if you ask him or her to be your friend, you will be friends after getting his consent. Similarly, if anybody sends you request and you accept it, you will be friend too. Thus, you and your friends together will build up your network, that is, social network. <coughs> Websites of social communication. People are mostly using Facebook. Every user can create a self-introducing web page, either in Facebook or in similar websites. The user gives the information of himself or herself and displays his or her photographs, videos, etc. The feeling you send is called status in Facebook and Tweet in Twitter. Facebook will remind your friends about your birthday. Not only for personal emotions, but also the advertisements, circulations of jobs are sent through these social communication websites. So, we can say that ICT has made our social communication fast, attractive, and effective. Social communication website, Facebook. Here you can see the Facebook, which is the social communication most popular website nowadays. From all over the world, people, all kinds of languages are using Facebook by creating their own personal account. Here you can you can see Rokaya Naim Pushpa's account, that is my personal account on Facebook. And here you can see that I have changed the last name. That means you, whenever you want, you can edit and change your names from here. And here is option you can see, that is add friend. This is the option where if you click here, then the friend request will be sent to your friend. If he or she accepts it, then you will be friend in Facebook. Here is another option, follow. If you add friend and the request will be sent and also as well as you can follow the person. Whether the person will accept your request or not, but you can follow his or her news feed. That means whenever whatever status she or he will give, you can see that. Here you can see that a picture, the big picture is called cover photo of the account and the smallest one is the profile picture. This profile picture will uh, introduce to you. So this will belongs to you. And timeline, here are timeline, here is the introduction part. Here you can see that um, I have given my introduction. In this part, you will give your introduction. I have written teacher at English medium senior section, master school and college. And here are some status I have given that hope that the world will get rid soon from this dangerous COVID-19 virus. This kind of status you can share here. So that's all about social communication website, Facebook. There is another popular website that is Twitter. Twitter is one of the um, popular after Facebook social communication website. Especially celebrities are using uh, this uh, website. Look here you can see that uh, Saki Wal Hassan account in Twitter. And here is a picture of that Saki Wal Hassan. Uh, he has opened an account in Twitter by his name. Here are, is option like Facebook follow. If you uh, click here, then you will follow your favorite person or celebrity and you will get news on your news feed. It's a very familiar of exchanging view of using Twitter. 
primary school classmate who perhaps now living in Australia was detached from you for a long time. When you will post any information in your profile, it will instantly be visible in a corner of your friend's webpage. The feeling you send is called status in Facebook. And if the status you write in the Twitter, then it will call tweet. If you like to display any photograph or show any video that can immediately be watched by everyone connected in your network after adding in your profile or social communication websites. Even social movements are being organized through it. It is widely supposed that these websites played a very vital role in organizing the social revolution in the Arab world, especially in Tunisia, Egypt, and Libya in 2010 to 11. Here is a picture is given that mass movements were organized in many countries of the world by using social networks. That means people come across all over the whole world, they gather. How they get the information? Only through social network. By social networking websites, they communicate and share their feelings. After sharing their feelings, they gather in the same point and do their movements. This is one of the most important part in social networking. So, my dear students, what we have learned from today's lesson? First of all, we have learned importance of information and technology in our social life. Then, how ICT has made our social communication faster? Last but not the least, how can we use different websites for social communication? There are some related questions, so here I have given some related questions for you that will help you to understand the pattern of the question which may come in the exam. So that if you follow these pattern questions and if you learn the questions from this chapter, then it will be very helpful for you for doing well in your exam. So the related questions are, number one, Explain about the importance of ICT in social communication. Second question, how can we build up our social network? Explain. Third one, how can we share our feelings by using different websites? Here is your homework. Learn and write the following question answer. How can we build up our social network? Explain. I hope you can write it very well as we have already discussed it in our today's class. Right? So, before ending the class, I want to say you something. That is last but not the least. I want to say you that keep care of yourself and stay at home from get rid of this dangerous virus, COVID-19, that is called coronavirus. And as we all know, that a different Ramadan month has come in this year. Hopefully, it will change us for the better, inshallah. Let's quarantine our minds, sanitize our souls and purify our hearts from all kinds of virus, forgive each other, and do good to the people around us. Ramadan Mubarak to all of you. Wish you all the best for your study and happy quarantine. That's all for today. Thank you.